have been talking about gluten, gluten-free for, I mean, from our very beginning of being personal trainers. Now, if you are, as you are from the senior active, you're obviously over 60, you have had no negative side effects from it, you've been tested by your doctor and all of your markers, your health markers are good, then no, you shouldn't stop eating bread because it's been doing nothing it's not done anything bad for you and all of those tests and all of those health markers show it. If you've never been tested, your health markers have never been tested, then you need to get that done. But also, if you've never not had bread, there's an interesting one as well because often you can just get rid of bread or gluten for two weeks, see how you feel, you feel amazing, clearly gluten is not for you. Well, it's like our grandfather. He has been told by his doctor not to eat anything with sugar in, anything at all. He's 91. He's fitter and more active than many people 30 years younger than him. And he's 91, yet he will not now have an ice cream or anything like that. Not that he had many of those in the first place anyway, otherwise he wouldn't be so fit and active at 91. But he's now not having any because he's been told by this expert not to have any, otherwise he's going to get diabetes. But he's 91, so that's not the right advice for him because everything to do with his health is really good. So. It's the wrong thing to say to him, but the, the, he's been told by this blanket prescription that no, that's bad, don't have it.